Welcome back, guys. Today, we're going to start up our Dragon Warrior 2 style here. Alright, so... Just like last time, we get to name our character. And just like last time with Dragon Warrior 1, your name does affect other parts of the game. However, instead of infecting your, affecting your stats, it affects your other... The other two party members, yes, we get two more party members, um, they, it affects their names instead. So, it's auto-generated. There's like a selection depending on values and whatnot. I don't know all the math behind it, but there's something like uh, each letter has a different value and such, so. Yep, we actually have party members this time. But anyway, of course, I'll be the hero. We want fast tech speed. Many years ago, a young descendant of Loto, the brave hero of legend, defeated Dracolord. That was me! And restored light to the world. Hey, Adventure Potato. <laughs> this is auto scrolling. The young man took a bride and left. On a journey, as they traveled, he. <laughs> Founded several new kingdoms. Again, this is auto scrolling. These countries came to be ruled. Really? How surprising. Oh, by the young man's children from one generation to the next. A hundred years have passed since Dragon Warrior 1. Moonbrook. They actually kept that name. A kingdom southwest of Laurasia, also known as Maidenhall. I don't like that name, Laurasia. In the castle's courtyard, the <laughs> king and the young princess engage in a pleasant and peaceful chat. But then... <laughs> but then... Then the screen shakes. What? What happened? Gods, is no one here? Your Highness, Moonbrook Castle is under attack by Hargun's army. What? Hargun dared to do this? Yes. Well, that sucks. <laughs> Confound that vile Hargun. <laughs> he basically said that. Hurry, rally away our troops. Yes, right away. Surprise! Dead. Listen, Lin. You stay hiding right here. Don't worry about me. But, but, Father. Hurry, go! I must inform the King of Laurasia of this attack. What? Monsters here? Take that! This king doesn't take no shit, guys. He's actually attacking. Uh oh. Take that, foul beasts! He's holding his own okay. Oh, said something too soon. F Father! She escaped, though. I mean, this castle falls. Nice shot, dude. Look at this badass here. I must get word of this to the King of Laurasia as soon as I can. Goodbye, Moonbrook. We hardly knew ye. Oh, but he's not looking so good now. That long travel. Fun fact, actually in the NES version, the princess runs back to her father stupidly and just stays there. <laughs> what? Look, he's wounded! Oh, I can actually control this now. What happened to you? Forget my wound. I must see your king now. 
if grave news for him. All right, hey, help me hold him. Carry him quietly. We don't need to cause a panic in the castle. Yeah, I mean, he's dying, but who cares? You know, panic is worse. Actually, to an extent that he's right, but... <laughs> But yeah, it's funny that the king actually basically said, well, go and found that Harkon, basically translating as, well, that sucks. I'm going to name this guard Gaspy. Look at him, he's gasping all the time. Your Highness, the wicked Hargon sent his army to take Moonbrook Castle. Hargon intends to resurrect an evil being to destroy the world. Your Highness, I beg you to stop Hargon and... Ugh. And he dies. Prince Tal, did you get all that? You two have the hero Loto's blood. I don't, but you do, because you're my son. Somehow that works. The time has come for you to prove yourself and the legacy of Loto. I'm old, so fuck you. There's no time for sorrow. Come with me when you are ready. <laughs> what a perfect time to test my son! <laughs> when the world's in the break of danger. Make sure this courageous soldier gets a decent burial. Not a great burial, just a decent one. Yes, your highness. Prince Tal, it hurts me to see you leave. Seriously, it, it's a, some sort of serious condition. I don't know why, but when you leave, I physically feel pain. It hurts. But this is for our people. I won't cry. <laughs> because of the pain, you know. I will pray for your safety. Prince Tal, please be careful. The soldier is dead. I'm the king now. No, no. So, let's look at our character first. I have leather armor. That's it. What a great kingdom. And no magic yet. Attack, defense. Alright. Oh, that was automatic. Tal, open the chest and take what you need for your quest. In Kanak and Moonbrook, you will find others who, like you, M Moonbrook fell, your, your highness, slash dad. Uh, why are you saying I'm going to find him in Moonbrook? Share the blood of Loto the hero. Band together with them and thwart those who bring evil upon us. Moonbrook's dead. What is the matter, Tal? Take what's in that chest. Well, go fuck yourself. Oh, 50 gold and a copper sword. Well, that's a little better. My, This is my kingdom, and all I get is 50 fucking gold and a copper sword. Go for Tal, my son, so I don't have to. Prince Tal, please be careful. Be sure to equip weapons and armor, otherwise they'll have no use. Yeah, yeah, you're trying to teach me, I know. Now I have 15 attack and still shit defense. We are such a rich kingdom, guys. You have no idea. <laughs> well, let's explore our castle. Where's the key? I don't know. I thought you had it. Adventure Potato, did you steal the key? I bet you did. Let's try here. Are you hitting out? It's dangerous. Monsters are especially numerous in forests and mountains. You should stick to grass and other open places. Tee hee. <laughs> oh, Prince Tal, it tears my heart that you are leaving. Oh, oh no, how can it be so rude? But please forgive me, Your Highness. Please forget about the feelings of a woman not worthy of you. So I can guilt you into marrying me. Basically. <laughs> Stepping into Traveler's Gate instantly carries you far away. This one leads to an island. Oh, let's see the island, guys. Uh oh, uh oh. Ah! I like it better when it was in the NES version. It was all it turns all rainbowy. <laughs> Well, this was 
Yeah, this was a total not waste of our time. Am I gonna get killed? No. Oh crap, monsters! Let's take out the slimes first. Start swimming, yeah. Uh, I think we're on the island from Lost, so it won't help. Except, you know, it's smaller. Well, we had our first battle. Alright, I'm gonna speed this part up. <laughs> Alright, we can't get in there because Adventure Potato stole the key. We got a priest. The gods smile upon the just. I urge you to visit temples on your travels. They are certain to be of help. Yep, like you were a tremendous amount of help there, dude. Alright, well, since Adventure Potato took the key, we can't do anything, unfortunately. This is Laurasia Castle. More like Mightenhall Castle. I will always say Mightenhall. Arf, arf, arf! This translates to go fuck yourself. That dog's rude, guys. Welcome to my item shop. How may I help you? Um. You know what? Let's take an herb for the road, because we don't have any healing at this time. You never know when it's gonna come in handy. In Kanak, there is a young prince, and in Moonbrook, a lovely princess. Except Moonbrook has fallen, so I don't know why I'm telling you this about Moonbrook. You would like them, Prince Tal. The town of Lethwin is to the west of here. People rest there while traveling to Kanak. That's super interesting. Alright, so, it sounds like Kanak's our next stop, but first, you know what this means we gotta do. We gotta level up, and as you may have noticed, we actually have more than one enemy to fight. I know, surprising, but it happens. Well, this time it didn't happen. So let's level up to like level three or something. Now, something to know about, oh, don't cross a bridge yet. But uh, something you should know about the my hero is that I am the physical wall I am the defense and offense, physical offense. Problem is, I will never learn a heal spell. I will not learn any spells. It's a very unfortunate thing. But, yep, the hero does not learn any spells in this one. Instead, the hero is considered all three of the characters in one. And it's something I really admire about the game. Okay, come on, let's hurry up. I admire that the game actually goes like, okay, uh, you know what? No, you're not the main hero. You're just the starting hero. I like that. A lot of health and some strength. All right, we'll just kind of zip around a bit. There we go. Really, right now, we're just kind of thwacking them, but it gets more interesting later. All right, let's go. Okay. All right, let's go with the slime. Almost time to heal. But yeah, I am the physical wall. Okay, it's time to heal up. Where do I? Where am I? I about to, was about to hit tab to find the map like I would on Don't Starve Juice. All right, let's go to go to the end and heal up real quick. We're level three now. Let's take a. Take a little bit of a walk. Oh, another thing is... We gotta be careful about... Uh, poison, eventually. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna get the leather shield first. And then, uh... I'll save up enough money for one antidote. Do we have a... Do we have an item bag in this? No, we do not. I love that. Yeah. There's still limited inventory in this. Man, you could use a nap, too. This late? Really? Adventure Potato? Wouldn't you just, like... Isn't that, like, sleeping right after dinner or at dinner or... Right before dinner? I mean, whatever. Dinner soon. Or... Just happened. Before dinner? Yeah, I'm a late dinner eater myself, so... <laughs> but... Still... 
I, I, if I wake up, just wake up, and then dinner's ready, I end up giving myself a stomachache if I eat right after. I have to give myself a time, a little bit of time before I can eat it. I try not to take naps unless it's like before, around four. That's like the latest, I guess. All right, I could go traveling around now. Let's see. All right. We can always one-shot slimes, it seems. Giant slugs. I think we can now that we leveled up enough. Ugh, the encounter rate. Okay, come on, yes. We know. Thank you. I was gonna buy an antidote, but there should be a town to the left here. Let's speed up the parts that are just, like, dragging here. Alright. I think we're in Leftwin? This is the town of Leftwin. You should rest your tired bones. I'll go rest your face. Oh, go to my item shop. Let's go buy an antidote, just to be safe. What else do you got? Nothing? Okay. The warp wing I'm not really interested right now. Oh, there goes my dog. What are you? Stored service. Very good. Alright, this is the inn. Poison weakens you as you walk. It can be cured with an antidote. Yes, thank you for literally saying that just after I get an antidote. Whoa! Don't startle me! Now look, my feet are all wet! This guy was pissing. And we basically just had a good look at his, uh, fun stick there. <laughs> Yay. For God's smile upon the chest, how may our temple serve you? You may not. Wait up, dude! Don't bother us! Well, go fuck you too! Um, if you go west, there's a shrine. You can get across to Moonbrook from there. My dad's a soldier in Moonbrook. He's great. He's also dead, kid. I don't know if he's the one that made it all the way to Laurasia either, so... <laughs> Alright, that was a dead end. Also, in this one, we can't cross over trees, but... It, that kind of makes sense. In the Nintendo version, you could, for some reason. Remember Hart said that the Prince of Laurasia is on a quest to bring Hog onto justice. Pardon? You're that prince? Yes. Oh, please. That's so silly. Pardon? You're that prince? No. Oh, please. That's so silly. But, well, really? Something's wrong with her. Hog got attacked Moonbrook Castle. Did you hear about that? Yes. Hmm. So the rumors were true. What a disaster. Uh, no. Oh, could it be true, I wonder? I buy and sell weapons and armor. What can I do for you today? Let's see, what can you do for me today? Eh, knife is not that good. Sickle could be kind of good, but it's only five more attacks. So, eh. Armor is going to be where it's going to be at. Yeah, I'll save it for the armor. Can a caster is far to the north of here. My kid brother is in Moonbrook. He's a soldier at the castle. Here's kid brother's dead. He suddenly came over one day and asked me to take care of his son. And that was the last I heard. Did something go wrong at Moonbrook Castle? Oh wow, you're taking care of that 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 guy was very good. What's this? A slot the slot token? Hey guys, I got a slot token. I don't know what that means. Lady move. Thank you. Damn it. Adventure potato. We need the key. <laughs> Alright. I guess, um... We'll travel up next. I think that's the way to Kanik. If I remember right. I'm just gonna fast forward the, uh... You hit it. Of course you did. But I'm gonna fast forward the little battle transitions.
Every time it says, where's the key, it's always asking you, Adventure Potato. Always. You get three guesses as to where it is. Up your bum. <laughs> Alright, get the Drackies out. Oh, really? Oh, they hurt. Close, I knew it. The Iron Ant has a little more defense. Oh, never mind, it doesn't. Well, we leveled up. Oh, I was on the right track. And now we're here in Kanak. Kanak. Welcome to Kanak. Look at my item shop. Let's see. Uh, repellent, warp ring, herb. Nah, nothing really interesting. May as well take a look around. I heard one called Argon, who appears to stir up unrest. However, when the bloodlines of Loto unite, evil will fall. Very nice. You can talk to prisoners through their cell bars. Kid, listen up. This is important. Get a hold of the silver key. I would love to, but Adventure Potato hit it. That key will open any door that has a silver-colored frame around it. Look what you're doing to us, Adventure Potato. Soon, soon the world's going to end. So what's a little theft, hey? Hmm. Well, Adventure Potato knows his theft. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if you can necessarily steal what isn't necessarily yours. So. It's not silver now. I knew it. It's bronze. <laughs> the gods smile upon the just. Okay, shut up. We don't care over there. Yeah, scumbag Kappa there. <laughs> oh, a gold key door. But where's the key? This is Prince Drew's sister's chamber. Really? That's his name, Drew? What a terrible name. You shouldn't be here. Well, screw you. Who are you? My brother's friend? No. Oh, I know. You want to sell me something, but I'm not going to buy. Uh, yes, I'm your friend. I better tell him. You tell you about him. My big brother is easygoing. He doesn't like to hurry at all. I bet he's making side trips. The prince has a sister that isn't a princess. I know, really. Ah, oh, Prince Tal, welcome. My son Drew has already departed. He should be at the Hero Spring. Go after Drew and join him. And then he's going to offer to save. Yep. Watch out for Drew. Blah, blah, blah. What a terrible name. One of the times I played on the NES version, I got Talent as uh, the Kanik, Prince Kanik's name. And another time I had Lars. I hate the name Drew. It's just, it just reminds me of Drew Pickles from Rugrats, who was kind of a, a turd, really. Prince Drew is sort of vacant. That, that sums up Drew. But he's basically a decent person. Far north of Eurasia Castle is a cave in which the hero spring is said to flow. Very good. But you would think, isn't the prince, doesn't the prince, uh, the prince's sister have royal blood in her, too? Or legendary Loto blood or whatever, too? How do they, is there, like, a test for this or something? Did they, like, give us a shot? And that's why my father's not going? He's just like, oh, yeah, uh, I don't have it. It skips a generation, but, oh, it's on you, so you go ahead and go get yourself killed. I'll be here. I heard the prince, yeah, can cast spells, but it's a bit frail. I heard he can't equip very heavy weapons or armor. Assuming the queen had the blood. You know what? That's true! Very good, Adventure Potato. You know what? I didn't even think of that. That is very true. The queen could have had the blood and not the king. And the queen, I guess, passed on. Some time ago, I saw the sky in the south burn red. I wonder if anything happened to Moonbrook. But in this case, 
both the, this prince's sister, apparently just his sister and not princess, should have the blood too, unless she's like a half-sister. Well, actually, that would make sense, because maybe both queens died, um, and the king remarried, and that's why this sister is not a princess, just kind of maybe a duchess or something. You know what? Hmm. My Fire Emblem Bloodline canon studying has paid off. That's true. Here's the thing. They never go into that. I've... As far as I'm aware, at least. But that is a... That's good to know, actually. I feel like we could craft a theory on that a little. No game theory. No, not really, no. But it's nice to... It's kind of a nice thing to ponder. Uh-oh, a healer. Guess what, guess what the healer does? If you guessed heal, you would be right. If you guessed, um, kill itself, well, you'd be wrong. So I get to do this for a while. Basically attack it until it runs out of MP eventually, maybe, possibly. Yeah, we're gonna be here a while. I think we should maybe level up so I can out damage the healing. Yeah, let's let's head back. Not to mention I need to heal, so. Whoops, I missed it. Uh oh, not a wild mouse. It's okay, I crit it. Wow, double crit. Alright, let's go heal up. It, do you have an inn here? This is a shop. God damn it. Meese? What's Meese? Alright, I'm gonna use an herb to heal. Okay, let's just go ahead and level up a little more. Oh, no, no, no. But we got new overworld music compared to the last uh, game. That's something that the I love about Dragon Warrior. They they always have like unique little songs for each iteration and and like use them in the right way. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It's just really good. Like I don't know. You can't walk in trees. You can't walk in trees in towns. You can walk in trees on the overworld. Okay, let's just go. Whoop. And another herb. Good. I lose my money anyway. 126. Can I afford another piece of armor or no? I like a hat, maybe? Hmm. Nah. We're gonna have to save up. Really, getting my defense up is the most important thing so I can actually tank more. But so, we know the prince and princess's name. We have Prince Drew. Ugh. And Princess Lynn, as we heard, saw from the beginning. Those are the two people that we gotta find. All right, leveled up. Let's just do that. Oh, a ghost mouse. I think her name is Lynn. All right, let's take a quick uh, in trip. You're not an inn. Not like the one from Fire Emblem. No, not at all. Each of them have different their own roles, really. As I already mentioned. This hero is going to be your physical attacker and tank. The other two will have different things to do. Alright, let's just, just kind of zip through this part. This part's just kind of like level up, level up. Oh, another herb. I want to be able to strike down healers if I need to, because if they're in battle with others, you don't want to... I'm not going to be able to, like, kill anybody if that's the case. 
Alright, give us one more level, I think. Now, don't use the item. <laughs> don't you wish you could do this all the time? <laughs> Just goes zoop, zipping through. Another herb, that's good. Almost got it enough. Okay, do, do, do. Nope. Well, I got plenty of herbs. There it is. Okay. Alright, that should be enough to get through. Also, just like last game, there is a level cap. Not that I think we'll actually hit it, but there's a chance we might. Oh. Alright, let's just get through these guys, and then we'll head towards that cave. Maybe we'll be able to deal with the healers a little bit better. How's my money? 342? Can I get something better? Let me see. Um, I can get a sickle sword. You know, a little more attack might be better. It's only five. That's why I'm like, eh, you know? Eh, screw it. I don't know. Chow, you have no space. Sell or discard something. That'll make room. Then come see me. It's supposed to be a chain sickle, but they uh, didn't really do a good job on that. <laughs> it's because they ran out of room in translation here. All right, I'll sell an herb. It's supposed to be, yeah, it's supposed to be a chain sickle. I think the armor is actually a better deal. So, you know what? I'm going to save up 40 more gold. I was thinking about it, but it's like, nah. Alright, that's 10. That's 21. That's 27. That's 38. Literally two gold more. Okay. Don't, don't walk ahead, dude. All right, let's get the armor. All right, and I guess I'll sell the... No, actually, no, wait. I want to hold on to it in case a uh, new ex-party member needs it. Okay, come on. Doot, doot, doot. How's my health? Yeah, it's okay. Eight, eight damage here. Alright, we've been over here already. Alright, now it's new territory I won't zip through. Other than battle transitions. Okay. Alright, that's not too bad. Mm, nothing there. But yeah, it was supposed to be a chain sickle and... In the old translation, it was you always had a copper sword. You always had uh, what was the other things? A nerve, but you have no space. Discard? No, no. There's something away? No. There was left behind. All right, no, stop. We're gonna use an herb. There. May as well. But yeah, leather armor and copper sword was like your staples in this game. You know, in the original game, every time you went through those little black things and... Oh, 88 gold. Uh, it would almost always summon a battle. Like, it always had a higher chance of, of you having to get into a random encounter. Alright, let's just kill you. No new enemies there. There are some changes from the NES to uh, Game Boy Color version, though. 
And I don't mean just like graphic wise or anything. There's some different spells that each of the characters can learn. But again, I'll get into that as as we get closer to it. To the other characters and such, so let's see. Oh, hello. Have you been baptized at the Hero Spring? No. That's bad. Find the Hero Spring. It is Narasia's Narasia custom for those who are heading off to battle to visit the Hero Spring. Honestly, what he's trying to tell you is, this is how you get an event trigger. As soon as you do this, you'll be able to find Kanek. I refuse to call I don't like calling him Drew. Not unless I'm angry with him. He is just Kanek. I'm Maidenhall, and the princess is going to be Moonbrook. I don't want what you're selling. <laughs> right, do, do, do. There we go. Now, the guy just wants to see me get all wet in the fucking spring, I'm sure, and be like, ah, you're all wet and gross now. I'll take the treasure chest. The antidote, but it has no more space. Nah. We'll leave behind the antidote. We already bought one. Welcome to the Hero Spring. Let me purify your body with this water and this little sponge I have over to the side. And pray for the great Loto to guide your way. May Loto protect this hero always. Gross. By the way, are you searching for the Prince of Kanek? No. Then go. May Loto's guiding hand be with you. Okay, fine. Uh, I gotta do this again. No, it's gross. Yes. You just missed him. The prince is looking for others who have inherited Loto's blood. His sister isn't one be for some reason. We don't know why. He should be on the way to Larasia Castle by now. He isn't, though. Also, we don't have a spell to conveniently take us out of caves. On the plus side, the caves aren't using the torch system anymore, so that's nice, at least. Okay, enough of that. Yeah, let's just go, go, go. You know, I remember one time I tried to get all three party members while being the lowest level possible. And I, because I wanted to get them all to level up evenly, but it doesn't matter because they each have different level maxes anyway. But all right, let's go find Kanek. Yep, 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 yep. You're dead. But yeah, this is actually the hardest game in the series. I believe uh, it still holds up. And it's not for a while to um, until we actually have to deal with deal with the hard part of it. Right now, this is the okay beginner baby step stuff. Anyway, the prince is actually over here. I forget if I have to talk to somebody first, but you should rest your tired bones. Eh, shut up. Ah, crap. I do have to talk to somebody else, don't I? Poison weakens to use your wall, can be cured with antidote. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How many of these games get remakes? Every single one except 9, 10, and 11 have gotten remakes. 1, and 2, and 3 were remade to death. They started with the remake on SNES, and now it's on... Uh, then it went to uh, NES. So, okay. I have to go to uh, Larasia first, I believe. Because they said he should be over there already. Yeah, I missed a, an event trigger. Uh, let me see. Dragon Quest IV has gotten three, maybe four remakes. I wish they would remake Fire Emblem games. No, they did with uh, Prince Marth's uh, one. Who do I have to talk for the event trigger? One to five or Japan only. Hmm. I'm kinda... yeah, yeah. 
They were made three. Number three or all three? Oh, rehashing of one. Okay. I would love a remake of Sacred Stones. Be sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Prince Tal, I wish I could go with you, but I must guard the king. Prince Tal, you look so much more noble. It makes me so happy to see you, especially because I'm not. You're not getting hurt. You're not hurting me now. Sacred Stone still holds up, though. It does. Welcome back, Prince Tal. The Prince of Kanak came looking for you, Tal. But when he heard you went to Kanak, he'd love to find you. Anyway, blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna record this then. Yeah. Let me do a quick save so I don't have to do all that again. Alright, so I had to talk to the king, got the quest, I mean, event flag. We'll go back to left wing. Yep, 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 yep. yep. The main thing I liked about Sacred Stones was the fact that you could level up everybody if you wanted to, if you took the time for it. Alright, is, is he there now? Yes! There he is! I'm Prince Drew of Kanak, but you could just call me Kanak. Could it be? You're Prince Tal of Eurasia? I said high and low for you! Let's join forces and fight as one! And now we have more party members with the Prince of Kanak, also known as Drew. If you want every gating level, you can level up anybody you really wanted. <laughs> oh, if you get every gating level. Yeah, that's true too. But now we have our first party member of the series. And he's underwhelming. He has a club and leather armor. Which means I could sell my leather armor. Alright. We will sell this. 113 gold, not bad. Uh, let's see. And he has a club and leather armor. Should I have saved my copper? No, I already have a copper sword still. And the copper sword doesn't do much for him. To attack more. Eh. Compared to the club. Hmm. Well, let's see. We can give him... Let's give him more defense. Um, uh, maybe I should buy him a chain armor as well. Or he should be wearing my hand-me-downs. I don't know. You know what? I'm going to give him... my. Yeah, I'll give him my hand-me-downs, so... He's never going to be a really great attacker. That's the thing. He can be an okay attacker. That's, that's all he gets to do. All right, and I'll pass this over to you. So yeah, he gets my old equipment, and that'll and he gets to deal with it. But the good news is, he has actual magic. And he has the first heal spell of the game. So, now basically, what he's going to be is a heal slave, until we level him up a little. The Prince of Kanak, unfortunately, has a bit of a bad rap. He's so well-rounded that he kind of sucks. It's kind of sad. He has a little bit of everything, and that doesn't really help much. But now that we got him, where are we supposed to go next? That's what we got to find out. Yeah, I'll take care of that, and you go for this. Oh yeah, you get a little different animation because I'm wearing, because I'm wearing a sickle sword on instead. That's why it looks like that. I guess it's to show that I'm throwing the sickle like that. But yeah, Drew is weak, unfortunately.
My favorite thing about the remake of Fire Emblem 2 is the, that the mages and clerics aren't one-trick ponies. They have a list of spells like an RPG. Interesting. Uh-oh, King Cobra. These are the ones that could poison us. Uh, you defend for now, Drew. And you got poisoned right away. Of course you did. And we're both poisoned. But we got promoted up to level 7. And I didn't get much HP there, but a lot of strength. Awesome, level 2. He needs to learn Antidote Spell. Because all we have is one Antidote here, and we both got poisoned, so that's not good. I give it to myself, because fuck him. Reminds you of, of Pokemon? <laughs> Heal me up. We gotta go back to town and deal with this. This text reminds you of Pokemon. Yeah, well, Game Boy Color era. Level 3. Good for him. He learns Fireball. See, now that's actually useful for a while. Uh, where's the... I don't know where the, um, place is. But he doesn't have any MP right now, so it's kind of useless for him. <laughs> Alright, let's just go... We don't need to drag the battle out. Yeah, he's taking damage. Okay. Luckily, just like in Pokemon, he doesn't get a hurt when he's poisoned in towns. Alright, how about you detoxify? Okay. Donation, six gold. That's cheaper than buying an antidote. I'm gonna give... Yeah, I'm gonna rest at the inn and get his MP back. They get hurt in towns? No, they don't. I was saying, similar to Pokemon, they don't. Oh, hang on. Is my mu is the music too loud or something? Hmm. Yeah, it's a little on the loud side. Not very. I'm just gonna lower it down a little. There we go. Both want to get hurt in town in one to four gen. Oh, you're right. I forgot about that because the towns aren't in transition. I think I meant buildings. Maybe? No, no, they do die in They do get poisoned in buildings, too. Huh. Well, in later Pokemon games, they don't. I and mean, they don't, so. And they don't even die to poison in later games, though. Alright, yeah, you guys die. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Come on, just go. I could ever figure out why my scream is being weird. <clears throat> I couldn't ever figure out why my scream was being weird. Oh, okay. Uh oh, Babel, get rid of it now. Very good, you got rid of it now. Oh, fun fact, in the original Dragon Warrior 2, if you and your party members attack the same thing, and the first, excuse me, and the first party member already killed it, the second party member would just miss. They don't, they wouldn't be able to retarget. However, in the remake, they fixed that, so to be a little more friendly. Well, we're just right now exploring. There is no hidden treasures, though, like in Dragon Quest XI. Oh, seven-year-old me. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing really good damage, and Drew's just kind of, like, piddling along. That's okay. 
He still are a valued member of our party. Ooh, army men. You know what? Army ants. Fireball. Oh, it's single target in this. Damn. Well, he can actually do okay damage with that. Though I generally have him hold his MP for healing for me. Okay. Just attack. Because apparently I can one-shot them enough. Well enough. Drew! Oh, Drew did it. I'm surprised by the low HP of the army ants. Yeah, my map presence in this game is a little rusty. Oh no, King Cobras. Definitely use Fireball. Ow, ow. Good. It's, a, it's Drew's way of being able to stick with us, I guess. There's a cave over there. I'm not quite sure if we're ready for it. Um, mm, sorcerer. And just in case I miss. I mean, not miss, but yeah. Don't kill him in time. Alright, good job, Drew. But yeah, Drew's taking a bit of a beating because he doesn't have as much defense as me. Well, that's my fault. I, I gave all the good equipment to me. But yeah, getting Drew this early is really helpful. Because it, it makes it easier to maintain myself a little bit better. And yeah, my my character is going to be useful for quite a while. Uh, fireball. As in the whole game, I'm basically going to be the main main role here. And I got poison, god damn it. Good, you're level 5. You should be able to handle stuff now. Ow. Yeah, no more antidotes. Do you learn antidote yet? No. I'm pretty sure he learns antidote soon-ish. Poison's the worst in the beginning here. Oh, nice crit. Yeah, let's head slowly back to town as I die slowly to poison. At least I have a lot of HP. Oh, no. I thought Drew was going to get poisoned. That poison animation is really jarring. Yeah, it's it's effective. And yeah, I bet you people like uh, Travis wouldn't really notice it. Because, you know, he needs something like just blaring at him to notice anything. And oh, Shrine of the Silver Monkey. Have you been to the shrine to the south of Eurasia Castle? No. My brother should be there, waiting for you to come. Please go see him. Okay. Hey, listen! Yep. We have the shrine of Eurasia. And I'll take care of that. Again, at least I have enough HP to be dealing with this. Okay. I gotta remember I have the warp key here. I think... I'm getting kind of lost in where I am. There it is. Alright, we'll detoxify... Detoxify. And then we will... Rest at the end. I forget if I went up here. Yeah, I did. That guy's father is dead because he, he was in uh, Moonbrook when it fell. He doesn't know that yet. 
Spoiler alert, it's for him. Have a nice day! Alright, let's see if we can get Kanek a little bit better armor here. Hmm. We'll sell the old club. It won't be that much money, though. Or it will. Okay, sure. Ah, four gold. I'm four gold short. All right, I'm gonna sell Nerve. All right, and now we'll buy it. <laughs> There, now he can at least take a hit. Oh, I could sell his old shit too. I gotta keep remembering that. By the way, I never thought that we would have beaten the, the final boss today. I know! Especially because, like, everyone had those their minor mess ups and all that, but oof. For those that don't know, Adventure Potato and I were playing with. All fun and games on uh, and don't start together's Forge. There's a new boss that came out, and I was debating on playing more Forge tonight, but I was like, you know what? I want to get started on Dragon Warrior 2. Oh, I guess let's go to Laurasia. But yeah, the new boss is tough. We had a decent strategy going, but we had some hairy moments too. I'll get into that when I play Forge on stream again. I might after dinner, who knows. Okay, let's just go through these quicker. So, south of Laurasia, there's a shrine. But yeah, there's definitely got to be a faster way than the way we did it, Adventure Potato. <laughs> it took too long, though. Yeah, well, that's because I wasn't really... I was being too cautious, and I was not really... I was not really, like, a helping attack, because I wanted to make sure I was ready to pick it up when you, when you die, you know? <laughs> that was part of the reason. And also, there's got to be another trick to it. I have been waiting for you. Dear Prince, hear me out, please. There are two kinds of keys. The silver key and the gold key. Adventure Potato stole and hid both of them, and you have to find them. There are also two kinds of doors. First, find the silver key. It supposedly lies hidden away in the lake cave west of Kanak. Oh, hey, someone's telling you. Uh, telling where your secret spots are. Cave west of Kanek, Silver Key. So that's where you hit it. Please, no more type of keys. <laughs> I only have so many holes. Oh, jeez. Nope. There we go. So we can end the battle faster. No, I didn't mean to flee. Whatever. So the cave west of Kanek is where we need to go. I'm actually enjoying the music a little bit here. Until now. Enter here. Oh wait, you know what? What about seeing his sister that isn't a princess? But yeah, it might be a little faster with Wigfrid, probably. This is the Prince this is Prince Drew's sister, this chamber. You shouldn't be here, even though Prince Drew is here. Brother, can I come too? 
Not a chance. Aw, oh, brother, you're mean. Yeah, I mean, why not, Drew? Technically, she is of, of Loto's descent. descent. One of Loto's descendants. <laughs> so that's the reason why she doesn't join us. Because Drew doesn't want any more party members. Or he doesn't want to endanger his sister. You know, one of those two things. I bet it's because he's a douche. Yeah, this way. Okay. I feel like I might have missed the cave. Oh, he can't two shot them. God damn it. Yeah, I missed the cave. Damn it, Drew. Here you go. Now he's picking up the slack. Learning antidote. So I don't have to run back to town every time. Really? Come on. Just, just die. Oh, a copper sword. All right, fine. I'll. That's okay then. No, I didn't miss it. I'm just messing up over here, guys. Jeez. Oh, someone ran away. Let's just hurry this up along. All right, I'll take care of a babble. You take care of the Draki. And he's poisoned again. All this MP is going to be to curing the poison, isn't it? Okay, shut up. And he's poisoned again, guys. And I leveled up. Up, there's the cave. Jeez. I don't know if we'll survive this with the poison all about. Yeah, I have three herbs to keep us afloat. Treasure? Alright, I'll take care of that. You start on the big rat. Yep. Me and him combined might be able to kill the healer. There we go. Power of friendship, guys. Agility seed? Ooh. Yeah, actually, I don't know if I want to give it who I want to give that to yet. I'll hold on to it. Nothing there. We're getting closer to finding your key. Or the key. Oh, I got hiccups. I had a, pu a, a mini pumpkin pie before I went on stream. Another slot token. I'll give it to Drew for now. Come on, you didn't even get the two shot him. And I'm poisoned. Okay. Antidote. Oh, perfect timing. Nothing down there. Oh my god. Let's focus on the healer. 
Very good. I'm gonna have to herb the herb Drew here. This is why you buy herbs, though. Hmm, some moss. Did you hide the key in the moss, Adventure Potato? Ugh, more King Cobras. Will I get poisoned? Oh, cool. No poison this time. Next time, I guess. Oh. Life acorn. Okay. I actually will probably give that to Kanik. I'm not sure. I gotta herb uh, Drew again. Oh, come on, Drew. Ooh, another another antidote. Good. We're prepared now. Nope, not in the moss. And Drew gets hit preemptively. Great. I just realized I should have been the one to... Oh! Desperate attack. Nice. I should have been the one to kill the King Cobra first. You know what? I think I'm going to have... Drew, for now, just defend. Another antidote? Good. I'll go left first. Treasure? Warp wing. We'll need that. And 245 gold. Oh, they are caught unaware. We may as well... Go ahead and attack all out. Damn it, Drew. Alright, come on. We got this. Oh, I forgot to defend with him. Uh so I can one-shot them, he can't. Aha! This is where you hit it, Adventure Potato! The Silver Key! Hooray! Well, now that we got some extra stuff there... We can go ahead and heal up with, uh... Drew here. He has enough for just a fireball spell now. Might want to put it in your bag pretty quickly. We don't have a bag. <laughs> Not in this game. It's trying to replicate the old school challenge of inventory management. Also, why was the key there? <laughs> no. You must have not been paying attention when uh, you hit it. Well, take care of the sorcerer, and you just defend, Drew. There we go. It's 
the best way for Drew to contribute. Be sort of tanky. Wait, defend! Defend like other game in other games uh, will lower your the damage that you are receiving. Alright, you defend. I think it's by half, I'm not positive though. Alrighty. Uh, Drew's not gonna be able to one-shot anything in a, for a while. Really? And you can't even two-shot them? Come on now. I forget if I went right. I did. Okay. And defend. And that's why we have antidotes. Because we found them and they knew that we would get poisoned. Time to warp wing. I think I'll take us to Laurasia. Oh, Kanek. Okay. There's no in at Kanek, though. Oh, there is. Okay, cool. I, I, pfft, I guess got it like, oh, you want to update this, right? No. Nothing good there. Okay. Okay, let's get going. Very good. Um, herb. Okay, good. I'm just trying to hurry this up. Oh, boy. Uh, King Cobra and Defend, I guess. Alright, there's the cave, and then the shrine should be a little further this way. I think? I don't remember where we found the shrine. <laughs> I'm just hurrying up through the battles we've been through. I won't be able to do this for long. It's not like Dragon Warrior 1 where it's just hit, 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 smash, hit, smash, and that's it. For now it is, but it won't be. Extra antidote is always good. There, that makes it go by faster. His fireball is much stronger than he is.
There it is. I wonder where the shrine went. Have you been to the shrine south of Razor Castle? Yes. Then I have nothing to say. Go fuck yourself, yeah. Please go right through. The town of Hamlin is south of here. Yeah, if you tried going here alone without Prince of Kanako, it would tell you it's dangerous to go alone. In more or less, more or less is what they would say anyway. But this is not a wrong key. <laughs> Check out the left first. Oh, magicians. Uh, does Fireball kill them? Yes, it does. Okay. It takes us to an island. Great. Oh, shoot. No, I didn't want to flee. I didn't want to do that. I just wanted to catch up a little bit. Drew's getting about as fast as I am, if not faster. Anyway, Ants do. Alright. But yeah, Kanik's never really going to be very strong. He's going to be okay at best. And now we made it to the next area. And there's more monsters! Hooray! Eh, another herb. Okay. The monsters get actually very dangerous around here. Oh, yeah. Uh, get rid of the Wizdraki, and you fireball the armor peds. Because I think they're the ones that I can't even one-shot. Is that correct? Ten defense. And one. Yeah. And you fireball the other. I don't fireball that one. Damn it. Extra turn. But that's a lot of money. And I'm going to use his MP to heal. He has one fireball left. Welcome to the town of Hamlin. This is a town where people meet. Aren't most towns places where people meet? Hmm. Wrong key. You may record your quest in a journal right here. <laughs> Life keeps getting more convenient. Alright. Da 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 da. Yep. There's a dog there. They got the church. There we go. Oh, wait, let's mess with him first. Revive. Revive me. Surely you just tell is alive. Detox me. But tell is not poisoned. Alright, uncurse me. But tell it appears uncursed. Nah. They had funnier funnier dialogue in the past, I feel. Excuse me, are you Prince Tao? I used to work at Lerasia Castle. It's like a dream to see you again, Prince Tao. And there's one of my many other people that are looking to date me or something, I guess. But anyway, we got more money now, so let's check out the weapon shop. Hmm. 
The spear would give him give a Kanek a lot more attack. He can't use steel swords. Oh, we both are using chainmail at the moment, but the steel arm. Oh, that gives me massive amounts of defense. Hmm. I feel like I need the defense to survive around here. But I also want to give Drew like ability to actually attack okay, too. Ugh, decisions, I hate them. Oh, wait, I have stuff to sell first. I did find that spare copper sword, didn't I? Yeah, I did. A little extra money. Hmm. Yeah, nothing else. All right, I guess, um... Defense is best. I'm upset about that, but I, I feel like I need it. Can I buy anything with that much? I don't think so. The sickle I can pass down. Mm. I'll get the spear next because that's actually going to be one of the better weapons for Drew for a while. It's sad, but true. Look, it's the item shop. Let's see. Uh, oh, you sell some lesser weapons and such. That's nice. Moonbrook Castle is southwest. Go west first, then turn south. Watch out for monsters. Stored service. Yeah, let's save. Actually, wait, hang on. Who are you? Want to play the slot machine? No. Come again. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna save and then we'll try it. Do you want to know how it works? Yes. When the wheels start rolling, press A button to stop them. Get three stars, get suns to win the jackpot. You're back from Smash Brothers Leak Land. Oh, there's a leak in the leak, huh? Well, the music is amazing. Sun's the jackpot. A gold card. Three stars get your second prize. A wizard ring. We offer other prizes, too. Let's play the game. Oh, it, it auto-chooses for you. Oh, that's too bad. Maybe next time. Please come again. Yeah, let's play again. Oh, too bad. Maybe next time. You want to play a slot machine? You have to do slot tokens. Oh, They went heavy with the horns, and I love it. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to cheat this, because I want to win at least one thing. I don't care what it is. Just give me one thing. What? That was close. I'll give you a slot token. Alright. Every time it's close, I get a slot token. Interesting. <laughs> Ooh! Yay, I won something! I went to the beat of the song to do that. You won the fourth prize, an amulet. Oh, an amulet? What, what does it do? Probably not much. Equip the amulet. What did that do? All right, let's try looking at this right now. Um, this says question marks. Okay. Info. Let's see. So I have 45 attack, 40 defense, 11 guard, 24 agility, 30. To I'm gonna. I'm gonna not remember this. Oh jeez. Uh, give me one sec. I'm actually just gonna type it real quick into my little search bar here. Because I want to keep track. Strength, 30. Agility, 24. Guard, 11. Attack, 45. Defense. What is my defense at? 40. Okay, we'll use this as a 
Ew, old names for stats. Yeah, I know. Alright, now let's see what wearing doing the amulet does. Thirty, twenty-four, eleven, forty-five, forty. Huh, nothing obvious. Maybe it's just for selling? Well, doesn't look like it does anything to stats, but I guess I'll hold on to it. Maybe it does something else hidden. I mean I'm not gonna save scum the whole time to get to use the slot abuse the slot machines and all. I just wanted to make sure I won one thing at least. I hear there's this flying cape in a tower somewhere. If you wear that cape, you can fly a bit if you jump from up high. Don't you forget what I told you. Fly for a bit. Just a little bit. And then you die. I think that's called falling with style. Law and order. Dun dun. It's breaking down. A pickpocket got me near Kanak. Luckily for me, he was caught. He must be locked up in the castle. Wahaha. -ha. Do you have any slot tokens? Yes. The slot machine is just for play. Don't become obsessed with it. No. When you shop for items, they sometimes give you a slot token. Very good. Yeah, it's a random chance. You can just keep buying herbs, really, and do it. Oh, I already talked to you. Your redundancy. Hey, doggy. Sniff. Oh! Hey guys, dog party! Dog has officially joined your party. No, no, she they haven't. And see, dog ran away. Uh, I already talked to you. Stop it. Stop it. Stop, no, stop. Shut up. I just was gonna see if they follow me. Yeah, Toby Fox dog there. <laughs> Did I talk to you? Flying cape. Okay, yeah. Blah blah blah. Alright, let's get to get an in trip and I guess we'll fight around. Good morning and have a nice day. Alright, let's fight around here first. Alright. I can only two shot and he could one shot with fireball. Damn it! You're wasting my turns here, Drew. On the plus side, though, uh, I can't take much damage from them, so that's good. I mean, I'm not. It won't take. I won't take much damage from them. Well, may as well look around. All right, I'll take care of the Wiz Dracky. You fireball. Very good. Oh, not enough damage that time. Okay, a Drew should not be bothering him to attack them when he when he's not gonna be casting like that. There we go. Alright, just attack these ones. Level 9. Wow, my HP and MP went up by 0. Great. Just get strength, and that's it? That's all I got was 3 strength for that level. That sucked. Hmm, nothing there. Do I have a warp wing? Also, you know what? I don't like Kanek being faster than me, so I'll use the Agility Seed. As for the Life Acorn, I'll give... No, I'm gonna hold on that. Hold on to that. Alright, I'll take care of the Scorcher, and you defend. Sorcerer, sorry. Let's see, 5 damage, and... 27, and still not enough, and Drew's taking heavy damage, so he should just defend. No AMRS music on Smash. That poor one arms fan. Which one is which? 
ASMR, you mean? I don't know. Oh, you get a couple stuff, stats and stuff spell you learn. Nice. Arms. I don't know what that is anyway. I'm not familiar with the brand. Alright, I'll take care of the sorcerer, you fireball the armor piece. Like the game with the long arms for the switch. Oh god, that thing, ugh. Yeah, it's probably for the better. That thing was creepy. I remember the demo for that arms game, that was just, ugh. Right now I'm just wandering around, but I'm not really going far because I will need healing soon to restore the Canucks MP. Oh god, bamboo. Uh, defend. Baboons, not bamboo. <laughs> Oh boy. Uh, oh boy, we're in trouble. Drew might die, though. He's gonna die just trying to heal me. Oh wow, we got lucky. Heal yourself. Oh, you're gonna have to attack. Really? Uh... Yeah, you, all you can do is defend now. Man, I wish I gave the herbs to Drew. Alright, Drew, it's up to you. Can you do it? Oh, oh my god. Wow. That was painful. I'm gonna save and I'm gonna run to town. If it if I get a random encounter, I was gonna just save scum. Oh boy. And here I was going on about how useless he is, and he just saved the day barely. My strategy was not panning out. I thought I had the defense for it. Wait, are you gonna? I'm curious. Now that I'm dead, do you have anything different to say now that I'm dead? Excuse me. Are you Drew? It's like a dream to see you again. Drew, when you were younger, the king often brought you here. It brings back memories. Oh, really? That's different. So she gives different dialogue based on who's talking to her. Interesting. Alright, anyway. I did not know that, actually. That was new. The gods smile upon the just. Roots revive me, please. 180 gold. Sure. That's about a few... That's about four battles, so... All right, so we're not ready to be crossing that bridge yet. I couldn't absorb all those blows. Ugh. And I should heal. I mean, uh, get Canuck's int back. Or er, MP back. I keep calling magic int, like, as an intelligence. Yeah, go get your intelligence back. You lost some. <laughs> Let's just stick around here, I guess, for now. You know, and you defend. Alright, we almost got our money back. Oh god, baboons. And lizard flies. Um, hmm. Get rid of these guys right away. Fireball them, if you have to. Very good. Oh crap, he uses fireball too. Yeah, baboons gotta get the hell out. Yeah, definitely need the healing. A slot token. Oh, cool. Well, that's nice. Uh, what I'm gonna do here is give my spare herbs to Drew, because if... I should always be attacking. Like, I am the offense. I rarely should be healing in battle. 
And I'm also gonna get... Actually, I'll hold on to the silver key. Uh... Yeah, there we go. I rarely should be using anything in my in battle since I'm always attacking. Alright. Fireball. Really? Let's try attack and attack. Nah, not enough. I was hoping it would be just enough. Leather armor. Ooh, we could sell that. I mean, we may as well make more money, you know? I think that's what we need is to get our defenses up higher. Because if I can't tank it, then we're screwed. <laughs> Under 13 gold, good. Uh, steel armor only gives me six more defense. So really, it would be more for Drew's benefit, if anything. He already has the chain armor. Like, Drew's basically be getting my, uh, my hand-me-down shield, is all. And then we have weapons after that. Yeah, I'll give him the spear so he can do a little bit more damage. Now I want to sell. And there we go. Whew. Again, he's not going to be a very good attacker, but it's something at least. No, damn it. Uh, let's try both of them attacking the same character. Okay, they could do that. That was helpful. And at least they're smart enough to attack the same monster too. That was an issue in the NES version. You got, if you chose to attack a group, it would attack anyone in one of them, one of them randomly. Thank you. Okay, let's just get through that really quickly. Alright, fireball. Really? Okay. Alright, I get the sorcerer, you get the armor peed. And he won't be able to finish them, of course. Yeah, he is enough for healing, so we'll do heal. We need money. <laughs> yeah, fireball the armor peed. Damn it. All right, I'll take care of the King Cobra. You finish off the armor peed. I don't feel like going to an inn just to cure the poison, so we'll use this. to go to the inn anyway, so fuck it. Yeah, this part's not the most exciting because I gotta build up my reserves and all that. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm good. Okay, let's zoom around at the speed of sound. Alright, I don't like you fireballing like that. I think, um... Maybe together we were able to want kill him. Yes, okay. Ah, uh, really? 
probably like one HP short. Yeah, here's the thing. There's a way to recruit the princess at this stage, but I'd have to take a huge risk to do so. Um, and I could be like skipping things that I don't need to get to yet. However, we are... I'd rather do the things the proper way, so we're gonna probably just go ahead and uh, do things the proper way. I still need to prepare because those baboons are fucking dangerous. Alright, same party again. Yeah, I'm, I'm warping through because this is just repetitive battles. I'm gonna go against the sorcerer still. I feel like the sorcerer is still more dangerous than this game, poisoned by the king cobras. Alright, king cobra, and you finish the armor feed. Very good. Oh, good job. Oh, smoke on the water. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, they have low HP but high defense. They're weird. Ah, oh, man. A whole party there. Uh, get rid of the Wizdraki still, and then you work on the Cobras. Very good. And more smoke. And get rid of that. How's our money doing now? Not 2,000 yet. That's what we need. Is That's our goal, guys. Oh, wait. You don't need to do that. You can just join in in the attack. You usually should be able to one-shot them. But yeah, there is more strategies with this game, usually. Usually. Than attacking, but... Sometimes, it's... If you can make it to just attacking, you're usually in the fine... You're doing better. You're saving resources. It doesn't always happen. And I got poisoned. I didn't know those could poison you, but whatever. Oh, boy. Yeah, we have to focus on them. Oh, shit. Just get rid of them as soon as possible. Are you kidding me? They hurt so much. Oh, a level. 2 HP. A little bit of decent stuff there. And Drew. HP, MP. No strength, of course. But a little guard, which is good. And more agility, so he'll be attacking faster. I think I'll need to carry some orb, uh, herbs to get through to the next area. Okay. Let's go ahead and use the inn, buy some herbs, and <clears throat> something gets caught in my throat. Great. Now, um, use the herb, buy some herbs after this, and we're going to try to get through uh, the next spot. The last place they told, one of the townspeople told us to go to, is the ruins of Moonbrook. For some reason. Just going to have a little bit of water. Drew hold a couple. Yeah, the herbs are going to be for out of battle he healing for the most part. And I'll cake one. Okay, and we have 1500 gold. 
the next thing I want to be getting... Oh, you know what? I can get the steel sword. I already bought him that. Yeah. Yeah, I can get the steel sword and get the steel shield later. So yeah, I'll go get the steel sword now and so I can get more damage. I don't need to pass down the chain sickle because he already has the iron spear. Or whatever that he, they're calling it. Slot token and Alright, we may as well use the slot token too. I'm gonna save. Oh! Did I get the rhythm? What's the hearts? Congratulations, you won fifth prize! Oh, warp point. Oh, that sucks. Well, whatever. It'll work out in the end. I'll accept that, you know? <laughs> really? Alright, I'm getting rid of the poison person, and you take care of the Wizdrak if you can. Yeah, of course. Well, at least Drew's getting strong enough to one-shot some things. Alright, let's see if we can find Moonbrook. It said go west and then go south. West first. Oh, very good, Drew. Really? Come on. Oh, lower our defenses. Ugh. Annoying thing. Oh, come on! Uh, I'm gonna get rid of the magic ant right away, and... You should fireball the arm feed. Okay, uh, I'll take care of the Wizdraki, you finish off the armor feed. Yeah, you can lower my defense all you want, it's not gonna help you much at this point. So, west first. And then go south. Ah, good. Drew was able to do it. It's the baboons that are the toughest, toughest tier that I don't want to have to deal with. Speaking of which... Yeah, definitely heal me. He's okay for the most part. Uh, I'm guessing at this point... Hmm, uh, try to attack the smoke, I guess. I guess that all- they're just big-ass defense machines, that's it. They don't seem to be casting anything. Oh, there's a tower. I don't think we're supposed to be going here. Not yet, anyway. Okay. Eh, cloth. Clothing. Whoopee. You must be Prince Tal of Laurasia and Prince Drew of Kanak. I see that you have honed your skills, however, I cannot let you pass. Not yet. You know yourself, there is another who shares Loto's bloodline. Find the Princess of Boombrook. 
She is still alive somewhere. Return only if you find her. I thought so. Okay. You could have healed us before we left. Whatever. I guess I'll go east and south now. Alright, I'll take the Wiz Draggy, you take the Armor Beads. I don't know if I can one-shot the Armor Beads yet as Tal. Let's see. Well, Drew attacked first, so that kind of made it a little harder to tell. How's our HP? It's okay. Mm, dead end here. And there's where we came from, so I guess it's south first. Oh, wait a second. I'm about to sequence break, guys. Because <laughs> uh, I missed my stop, so to speak. Oh, but we got a zombie. I'll attack the zombie. Hmm. You have to defend for now, Drew. Healing a zombie, that's bullshit. You can't heal a zombie. I wasn't sure if the zombie was gonna be faster than us. That's why I had Drew defend at first. Because the zombie's actually kind of strong. Healer's breaking the law of zombies right there. But I'm about to sequence break because I know exactly what to do here. See these multiple bridges? Well, if I went to Moonbrook first, like I was supposed to, but I kind of got lost and ended up over here where I'm supposed to, they would tell me there's a special mirror that is found in this swamp over here. Uh, I don't know which square it is, but let's see. Lar mirror. Sequence break, yeah. We get the Lar Mirror, which is supposed to be short for the Mirror of Ra, but they had to make it shorter because of text limits. It's not a huge sequence break, it's just like, you're supposed to find, be told where to find it, that's all. But I knew this part. Oh god, Magic Ants. Uh... Okay, you can one-shot them too, good. Yeah, sleep is bad. No, no, no. Well, in this case, sleep is bad. Alright, well... Oh, come on! Mm. I'm gonna say... Get rid of the zombie first, then we'll get rid of poison. Really? You couldn't finish him? Alright, I'll finish the poisoner, you get the zombie off. Good. They can't really hurt us much, they could just put us asleep and that's it. Okay. Nope, don't need to heal yet, me yet. Alright, I'm just gonna go left for now, because I don't know what happened to Moonbrook here. Oh! Pfft. Hey guys, we found Moonbrook! <laughs> Well, let's find out what I was supposed to be told. How's my HP? Okay. Oh! I forgot about that. Uh, I'll take the smoke, you take King Cobra. I am the soul of Moonbrook's king. My daughter Lynn was turned into a dog by a curse. The shame of it. A dog, you say? Hmm. It's Hagan. Hagan's army is attacking. Help! Yeah, 
we don't get ghosts here. We get spir fiery spirits. Hmm. The zombies are probably worse, but I think I'm going to get rid of the cobra and, and the smokes just to get rid of them for sure. Wow, double crit on the weaker enemies. And zombies aren't hurting me much. They might hurt Drew a lot. Oh, not much. Okay. They're just big tanks. That's it. Good to know. So they're not really a threat. Good to know. You know what else is good to know? Things that are good to know. <laughs> yes, I'm realizing I'm saying it too much. Uh, empty. Empty. No treasure for us. We can't loop the castle. East of here lies a small swamp within sight of two bridges. The La Mira is there. I cannot die until I pass that on. That's where we're supposed to figure that out. Oh, metal sign! <gasps> wow, Drew. Drew just being a badass right there. He just got us some serious experience. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. A thousand and fifteen experience points. Level up. I wish I got the princess first now. And a level up. And we learned the spell of return. And he dropped a Chester chest? Iron helmet. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That was a lucky ass... A lucky ass battle right there. Oh my goodness. There wasn't a bad luck at... Bad ass. It was a... Lucky ass. Ugh. Oh, I can't wear that helm? Oh, I'm not wait I'm not holding it, that's why. Well, can Lars equip it? Because I'd be fine with that. He's unable. Okay. Wow, though. Alright, um we're gonna have him hold on to the warp wing, I guess. And uh, he can give me the iron helmet. Pretty damn good defense. Also, we may as well use the herbs that we have. I forgot that, you know, we're trying to save MP. But you may recognize this part from the beginning. Yeah, you might recognize this part from the beginning. Um, this is where the king and princess were. The princess ran down those stairs to avoid danger. What the hell was that? That was a weird noise. He's like... Dew, dew. <laughs> Alright. We'll both focus on the king cobras, because I don't think the smoke or zombie matter much. The zombie might... Uh, poisonous, I think. Eh, and of course, that dude poisons us instead. No! I didn't want him attacking the smoke. Uh, do I dare check 4chan for leaks? You can if you want to. You could also check a diaper for leaks, for all I care. <laughs> He's still def defending. In before Sands, yeah. <laughs> you know, in all honesty, I would not be opposed to having Sands in there if they actually allowed it. We aren't that dumb people. Yeah, I know. Alright, you antidoted. Is there anything else that we could find here? Oh my god, stop it! Alright, I'll take the smoke, you take King Cobra. Come on, come on, just, come on, just kill it. There we go. Yes, there is a way around, but we have to suffer through the swamp. Another medley. I wouldn't be opposed. Yeah, exactly. I, if, I think Sakurai would do it him justice. But at the same time, I don't think it would, I don't, I would think, oh, Shovel Knight would have to be in first. Shovel Knight's an assist trophy. They made him one. But actually, 
Sans as an assist trophy would make much more sense to me, too. Eh, medley went away. Yeah, we're gonna heal up like that, and... Oh! Nah, I thought there was a way around it that way. Okay, well, we're just gonna go and uh, warp wing back then. Well, anyway. So, we got that mirror, right? But what the hell are we supposed to do with that? Well, they mentioned that the princess was turned into a dog. And now we have a dog party! Yay! And she likes to follow us, so obviously this must be the princess. Right? Well, maybe. Anyway, we have to lose her first, and then we could use the... So we could use the, uh... The mirror on it. And it... They ran away. Stop running. Tal peered into the large mirror. In the mirror, a beautiful princess was reflected. The mirror shattered and the curse was lifted. Oh, it's so good to regain myself. I thought I was doomed to remain a dog forever. My name is Lynn, the Princess of Moonbrook. I imagine you already know, but Moonbrook Castle was attacked by Hagen's army. I was turned to a dog by a curse. And they exiled me here. I can't imagine what happened to Moonbrook Castle. No, I won't think about that now. Please, let me join your quest. Let's fight evil together. And we got final party member with the Princess of Moonbrook, Lynn herself. Again, the names change, but... We got all party members. And one thing to note when you have all party members... New Overworld music! As you can tell, Lynn has a lot of mana. She starts with the Heal More spell, which doesn't really need to be used right now, because we don't have that much HP. Um, so essentially, this is our team, guys. We have me, who's just Brute Strength and Tanking. Drew's kind of the in-between. He has some healing, some, some magic spells, but he's... And some some decent physical tech, but not great. Then you have Lynn, who is our pure maid. She's healing and offensive magic. Some people like to make uh, Kanik, the Drew here, um, the, just the healer. But he's really not good at that because, yeah, he it's just not what he does. He can heal. He's just not the healer. So let's make, take an in trip. And you know what? I think we're going to end it there, guys. Uh, one, dinner's ready, and two, uh, <laughs> two, I, we've been streaming for two hours. I think that's enough for this. I might come back later tonight, um, depending how I feel, really, because I don't have work until later in the day tomorrow. I don't believe I'll be streaming tomorrow because I have a very annoying shift, so. Mm. Two to ten, and then the next day after that is going to be eight to one, so fun. So, uh, most likely you're going to see me on Monday. So, have a good one, guys, and take it easy. Bye-bye. After we get saving. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Take care.